The Grand Bacalet Juvenile Rehabilitation Center is now home to an additional 15 juveniles recently sentenced by the court. This latest development with the nation's young people and other issues in the school system has sparked concern, especially for Minister for Education, Emmeline Pear. Her concern hinges mainly on the number of juveniles appearing before the court. I want to speak first as it relates to development in some of our schools that we are very concerned about as it relates to students' behavior. We hear a lot of stories. As a matter of fact, some of you know that in some areas, we do have a number of our students who are going before the court for very serious matters. As a matter of fact, the Grand Bacalet Rehabilitation Center, some months ago, received some 15 students at one time being sentenced by the court. The education minister says the situation should not be taken lightly and calls for a collective effort by society. She says measures will be adopted as a means of saving these young people. We will be soliciting the support of our parents because a special committee was appointed to look into a special program of support for these students. And so when we make a public announcement of some of the measures to be taken. Some of them might not be very traditional, but we look forward to the support of our parents and the general public because we believe what we want to do is to save these young men particularly and to ensure that they do not end up another place in the future. Trained staff is on hand to provide counseling and training for those warded at the center. The center was established in 2016 as a viable option for young offenders under the age of 18 instead of Her Majesty's prison. The center was built to accommodate 75 residents for a period of three months to three years. Christina John, GBN News.